Working from the comfort of one's own home, or from anywhere in the world in fact, does indeed sound very appealing. However, things can get a bit tangled as soon as you start asking yourself how to find a remote job online in practice. And that's why we're here to guide you through everything you need to know about remote work opportunities. What is a remote job? Simply put, a remote job is a job that is performed outside of a traditional office. In other words, if you aren't physically in the same building as your coworkers or clients, you're working remotely. In reality, there are different levels of working remotely. Some companies require you to be in a specific country, state, or city. Similarly, some remote jobs require you to be physically in the office to a certain extent. These are referred to as partially remote jobs. Nonetheless, there are jobs that are 100% remote, meaning you can work fully from home or anywhere else with no need to be in a company's office. So where do you find remote jobs? Many job boards meet the demand by only listing jobs which can be done remotely. These are the six best sites for finding a remote job, and I'll leave the links to them in the description. FlexJobs has been the number one job site to find remote work in the world since 2007. At the time of shooting, FlexJobs listed over 30,000 jobs from almost 6,000 companies. They include giants such as Apple, Dell, Xerox, and Pearson. You can search by job category, location, or look for jobs in a specific company, all remote. WeWork Remotely is the largest remote work community in the world. It's extremely user-friendly since you can very intuitively add any filters you want, including location, company, category, type of work, i.e. full-time or part-time. WWR is also being constantly updated so you won't miss anything. Just Remote claims to help you find 70% of live jobs which never get advertised for a low price of $5. It's a powerful remote job search platform listing fully or partially remote positions in high-quality companies around the world. AngelList Unlike other job boards, AngelList is targeted specifically towards startups. There is no fee you have to pay. You'll have to make a profile, however, which will serve as your resume. You can select startups, which you find interesting, and if a company likes your profile, they'll reach out to you. Hubstaff Talent promises no fees, no markups, no middlemen. Hubstaff has thousands of remote startups, software companies, agencies, and e-commerce businesses that are looking for talent. As a freelancer, you can start a profile and let companies contact you directly. Remote.co is a great place not only for finding a remote job, but also for learning a lot about working remotely. Remote.co is a partner company with FlexJobs, which promises expert insights and the best practices in remote work career. If any of the mentioned sites doesn't work for you, try some of these. How do you get a remote job? Make sure remote work is really what you want. Start by looking at the pros and cons of remote jobs. Some of the pros obviously include no commuting, working from anywhere, or no office drama. Cons include loneliness, limited socialization, over or underworking. Working remotely isn't for everyone. Make sure your preferences align with the policies of the company. It will definitely help improve your job experience if you're on the same page. But that goes for any kind of job. Decide what type of remote job is the right fit for you. Ask yourself, am I looking for a full-time and strictly remote job? Do I want a remote job based on my location? Is working remotely for a company based in another country really for me? Tell your resume for a remote job application. Talk about online tools, software, apps, programming tools you can use. Really emphasize your communication skills, self-sufficiency, and autonomy. Don't forget to include a link to your online portfolio. Prepare for a virtual job interview. After you find remote jobs, you'll inevitably have to do a virtual job interview. Make sure you prepare well for this part of the job search process and leave nothing to chance. We've made a whole video on how to prepare for a virtual job interview. You can find it in the top left-hand corner. As more companies and employees begin to realize the benefits of remote work, many companies decide to offer permanent or long-term remote jobs. The top fields hiring for remote jobs are traditionally technology and computer-based careers. However, there are plenty of jobs from different industries as well. Computer slash information technology, including positions such as IT managers, software developers, or database administrators. Marketing. There are so many options, including market research analysts, campaign specialists, product marketing managers. Human resources and recruiting includes employee experience managers, talent sourcing researchers, HR assistants, and many more. Customer service. This is probably self-explanatory. What are the best companies to work remotely for? In 2020, FlexJob analyzed 57,000 companies' remote job postings. Based on that, they put together their eighth annual list of the top 100 companies to watch for remote jobs. Businesses with the highest number of remote job openings made up the final list. Overall, the companies on the top 100 list have their headquarters in 11 different countries, 
which reflects the continuing worldwide recognition and transition to remote work. These are the top 10 companies if you want to find a remote job with ease. As more and more companies are beginning to operate remotely, recruiters and workers are finding firsthand that it takes a distinct skill set to work from home. If you're brimming over with these qualities, it will be no problem for you to find remote jobs. Self-organization. It's super important to stay motivated and have good organizational skills. There's going to be no one looking over your shoulder to keep you organized and motivated, so you need to become your own supervisor. You should keep up with your schedule and your routine. Technical slash digital proficiency. Hiring managers who specialize in recruiting remote workers need to see that you're comfortable with technology, digital platforms, and online tools. Communication. You may think that if you work from home, you won't have to engage in much communication, but that's far from the truth. The ability to communicate effectively with your superiors and colleagues is essential, whether that's via video calls, phone calls, or email. Good written communication skills are especially desirable. Independence. Remote workers are usually expected to work independently without too much supervision. It's important to take initiative when required to understand what needs to be done and to do it without constantly being reminded. Teamwork. Since virtual teams are more culturally and geographically diverse than ever before, it's becoming more difficult to coordinate and work effectively as a team. Teamwork skills like conflict management, listening, and reliability are key to successful cooperation. Working remotely can be harder than it seems. Especially if you've never worked a remote job before, the transition to working from home can be challenging. Take these six quick tips on how to work remotely. They can make the whole thing a bit easier to get into. Set up a remote office in your home. By devoting a separate space in your home solely for work, you'll find it much easier to get in the work mindset. Follow a daily routine or a schedule. It's much easier to get things done if you set your own personal deadlines for your tasks, since there is no boss coming to check up on you, at least not until it's too late already. Communicate online. Talk to your colleagues or supervisors just the way you would in an office. It's important to create and maintain good working relationships. Know when to leave work. Are you working from nine to five? Don't lose track of time and know when to sign off. It's important to know you don't have to be available 24 seven despite working from home. Find a remote office. Working from home doesn't mean you have to work from home home. If you feel like the side of your bed is too tempting, try a local coffee shop instead or rent an office space nearby. That was the ultimate guide to remote working. Hope you found it helpful. If you did, consider subscribing to our channel and hitting the like button on this video. It helps a lot. See you next time.